Lighting is activated. Lighting is activated.
Lighting is activated. Welcome to the monthly assessment, Dr. Barlow. Very nice. And that's why you distracted me from my work. There's no one here. Watch hasn't been detected. To start the training, take your Amber's watch. Training simulator will be activated in 10 seconds. And for this, I graduated Three, from two, MIT. One. Can't believe it. The training simulator is activated. Mandatory safety briefing in Ember Spark. No exit allowed. You are to pass through eight rooms learning key part work teachers. Welcome, employees. Place your Halloween handleless auto doors to open. Inhale safely with fingerprints. Great job. Go to the next room. Activate power in park houses manually if system malfunctions. Power stations, fuel doors, light, and amber stores across the park. Great job. Master Amber Star signage first. It guides you with colored lines, pointers, wires, both indoors and outdoors. 
crucial for successful duty fulfillment. Oh, come on. Who's here? Susie, is this a new part of the training? Doors are closed at night to prevent unwanted behavior. Get hacking out for emergency door unlocking. Consult tech specialists or buy for app terminals located around the park. Hack doors with Amber Swatch. Open app, choose nearest door. Need an Amber Swatch? Contact Supply Department. Is anyone alive?
Don't worry, Spartan is located in a special chamber that neutralizes most of its sight abilities. Normally, they keep it invisible to the test subject. If an employee unintentionally acquires the marker, report to the security department with Sparky's position. Use specially configured tower viewer to monitor Sparky's location. Adjust tower viewer using the hacking app following the protocol. Susie, where are the watchers on duty? Rooms, use marker gun on special dummies. Dr. Barlow, I remind you that the result of your certification depends on the time you spend on completing test tasks. What the? There's a monster roaming around the complex and I'm still testing? Go to hell, Susie. There's no way I'm doing this. What the hell are they preparing us for? Spark is completely crazy. Believe me, you will not get off with one complaint. Great job. Go to the next room. purposes maintain distance sparky does not pose a lethal threat to people without the marker failure to keep safe distance may cause disorientation stay safe susie what the hell all the monsters must be in mentally shielded boxes being in an ordinary cage it can easily take control of me Give the signal. Another monster has broken free. Announce evacuation immediately. You don't have the authority for such a requirement. Until the certification is completed, your admission is invalid. Hate you!
One day the public will find out about your dirty deeds in this damn camp. I swear, if not me, then someone else will shed light on this terror. Is this place already against me? But you, Ethan? Cut it out! We have to stick together! In case of Sparky's uncontrollable state and unavailable security employees, a park employee must intervene. Determine monster type inside Sparky. Indicate. Damn, damn, damn. Easy, Sandra. You have to focus. You have to get back to your son. Proceed to the next room. the gastronomic preferences of the monster inside Sparky. Another indicator for determining the monster type. Analyze Sparky's use using the chemical gun. 
Human food triggers reactions and secretions. Preferred eating spots. Secluded, dark basements. Conduct analysis in the basement. These creatures also love innocent children for lunch. Can we talk about this, Susie? Everything. Over here, here is the exit. Dr. Flores, is that you? What exactly does Spark know? Hmm. I've never been in this wing. Log entry 3476. Dr. Bennett is here. We're tracking sonic anomalies left by the monsters. The patterns are emerging. Anger, apathy, fear, sadness, all from sound. Terrifyingly ingenious. Now Dr. Spark, our guiding light. His genius is the driving force behind us. Admittedly, he does play favorites. Log entry. 3,498. My new portable sound analyzer is ready. We need to face these sounds to understand, to gain control. My colleague, Dr. Price, he's chasing shadows, or so I think. Some runes, marks, a lamp to see them. Is that even productive? Only time will tell. Of course, everyone wants to get the Nobel Prize so much that they completely forgot about scientific ethics. However, it looks like Spark is really close to a breakthrough. Log entry 3509. The time for testing is at hand. We've isolated some sonic anomalies in a secure test chamber. If you're hearing this, then it's your job to take the analyzer and find these anomalies. This is our chance. Our opportunity to understand and confront these monsters. Their sounds. Take the analyzer, enter the chamber, and listen carefully. Log your findings and stay alert. And don't worry about Price and his runes. The sound is where the truth lies, the real answers. Trust in the analyzer, trust in the process, and trust in Dr. Spark. Only Spark doesn't disdain experiments on people. It is a crime to be able to heal, but to continue to destroy. Log entry 3502. Price is like a dog with a bone. Wasting resources on his rune obsession. It's infuriating. Dr. Spark, though, he's our anchor, our lighthouse. If anyone can help us tame these monsters, it's him.
Log entry 2124. Dr. Price is here. These monsters, they leave a mark, a rune. It's not visible to the human eye, but my studies show they're ever present. A sign of possession, perhaps? Or a warning to their own kind? Now about Dr. Spark, the man who fuels our scientific pursuits. His mind? Truly remarkable. Though I often wonder why he wastes his time with certain, shall we say, less focused colleagues? Log entry 2137. I've been perfecting a unique device, a lamp that can illuminate the hidden runes left by the monsters. I believe these runes hold the key to understanding them, to controlling them. Dr. Bennett, on the other hand, obsessed with sound, with noise. Does he really think these monsters can be understood through their cacophonies? Hmm, we'll see. I'm sorry, Dr. Price, but seeing rules doesn't mean being able to decipher them. And in this matter, you are a real layman. I wouldn't even trust you to drive a scooter, let alone control monsters. Log entry 2148. I've detected potent rune activity in one of the test chambers. If you're listening to this, you're tasked to investigate it. Take my rune lamp. Reveal what hides in plain sight. That's our first step to gain control. Go now to the chamber. The lamp is essential. Don't be swayed by Bennett's sound theories. True understanding lies in the runes. Trust in the lamp and in Dr. Spark. It's all lies all around. I came here to develop a cure for all diseases. And as a result, I became a participant in a new Montauk project. Resources. Yet Dr. Spark trusts in all our research, his wisdom, his faith. It's the one thing that keeps us together in this chaos.
Lustrum simulates emergency situation to test employee actions and acquire knowledge. Marker provided for enhanced simulation. You know, Susie, if one day a truly advanced AI appears, the first thing it learns is how to hide how smart it is. What do you think? Nothing? Maybe you really are smarter than you look. Neutralize part is a special internal located in the park. Activate them with key light. Key light can be found in residential complexes. Hand the key terminal to lock key light depending on the type of Sparky's monster. Yes! Did I pass this stupid certification, Susie? What do you think? I think you unreasonably think you're too smart, Dr. Barlow. I don't particularly care about it. 
but Dr. Spark asked me to tell you that he is ready to put up with any shortcomings of his employees, except for one thing, a tendency to betrayal. <laughs> I'm sorry? What kind of betrayal? What are you talking about? Hey, Susie, don't be silent. Susie! Don't you dare mention my family. You think you scared me? Straight, right or left? Straight, right or left? Son, don't be afraid. Nothing will happen to mom. I'll be home very soon. That's what you're putting innocent children through? Don't doubt it, Spark. I'll get out. I'll get out, and you'll regret it. My boy, 